In recent years, increased cultural sensitivities have caused audiences to question what's appropriate and what isn't in terms of comedy. Many TV shows in the past have featured characters in blackface for satirical purposes. Though the creators of these shows no doubt thought the use of blackface was justified at the time, many programs have now had either scenes or entire episodes removed from streaming services as a result. Join Trender as we take a look at TV shows that have been taken off the air for blackface. 30 Rock 30 Rock was a comedy that aired on NBC, and several episodes of the show have been made unavailable to the public due to depictions of blackface. These were made unavailable at the request of Tina Fey herself, the creator of the series. They have been removed from streaming and syndication, but also have been made unavailable for digital rental. The first of the four 30 Rock episodes made unavailable is the second episode of the show's third season, titled Believe in the Stars. The characters of Jenna and Tracy are trying to determine whether African Americans or women in general have a harder time in life due to societal prejudices, causing them to attempt to spend some time in each other's shoes. For Tracy, this means dressing up as a woman. For Jenna, this involves her dressing up as an African American. The next episode to be made unavailable was the second episode of the show's fifth season, titled Live Show. This episode featured Mad Men star John Hamm in blackface. This was especially notable considering the fact that Mad Men had also been affected by blackface controversy. The tenth episode of 30 Rock's fifth season also featured a blackface gag, and John Hamm appeared once again in a sixth season episode to capitalize on the success of his initial blackface appearance with another one. All four of these episodes have been made unavailable at the request of Tina Fey in light of increased racial sensitivities. Scrubs Scrubs was an ABC series predating 30 Rock by a good number of years. Three episodes have been made unavailable from Hulu at the request of the show's creator, Bill Lawrence. The first episode was the eighth episode of the show's third season, titled My Friend the Doctor. The episode featured Zach Braff in blackface to pull off a visual sight gag where it appears as if his character is actually another. The gag is purely sight-based and has no racial connotation. The second episode removed was called My Jiggly Ball, and it features a similar similar sight gag in which Zach Braff's character imagines what a hybrid of two racially diverse characters would be like. Similar to the aforementioned gag, the comedy comes from the absurd visual element as compared to any racial connotation, though the episode has still been made unavailable. The third episode to be removed from Hulu was My Chopped Liver, the 17th episode of the show's fifth season. It features a more racially aware gag featuring blackface, in which Zach Braff's character is beaten up for ignorantly wearing blackface while visiting a frat house. Community Community was another staple of NBC's comedy lineup that featured blackface. Unlike 30 Rock, only one episode of Community has been affected by blackface controversy. Also, the episode is still available to watch through digital rental. The episode's title is Advanced Dungeons and Dragons, and it features the Asian character of Ben Chang adorning full-body black paint in order to represent an imagined fantasy character for the role-playing game. African-American character Shirley understandably takes umbrage, though Ben's intentions were not to cause anger or offend her heritage. The Office the Office has only had one single shot removed from streaming and syndication due to blackface controversy. The shot appeared in the episode Dwight's Christmas, which was an episode of the show's ninth season. It featured a culturally aware blackface gag that was meant to poke fun at racist practices of the past. Show creator Greg Daniels offered an apology alongside the removal of the shot, saying he had good intentions but regrets the choice. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to Trender for more. And stick around for more shows that have had blackface controversies. It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia As far as American series, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia takes the cake when it comes to the number of episodes made unavailable from blackface controversy. While British series The Mighty Boosh and The League of Gentlemen have been removed entirely from Netflix as a result of blackface characters featured throughout, no American show has had more episodes removed from streaming services than It's Always Sunny. The episodes of the show that have been removed include not only blackface depictions, but also insensitive depictions of characters characters dressed as Taiwanese stereotypes. The gags were all at the expense of the characters doing the racially insensitive activities, but that hasn't stopped Hulu from deciding these episodes shouldn't be available on their streaming platform. Still, they're available through digital rental. The show's creators have yet to comment on the removal of the episodes from Hulu, though the show has always been known for controversial comedy.
The Golden Girls One might not initially think of The Golden Girls when they think of controversial comedies, but one episode of the show has been removed from Hulu as a result of a blackface gag. The gag featured the characters of Rose and Blanche introducing themselves to an African-American character while wearing mud masks, resulting in a misunderstanding wherein the character thinks they've done themselves up in blackface to offend her. With Bob and David with Bob and David was a successor series to the cult classic HBO comedy series Mr. Show with Bob and David. With Bob and David premiered on Netflix in 2015, and its third episode featured a blackface gag involving African-American comedic actor Keegan-Michael Key. This stands as a rare example of a situation in which the creators of a show have actually spoken out against the removal of the episode, saying they stand behind the motives of their comedy. Series creator David Cross has always been outspoken about his liberal beliefs, balking at the idea that the racially aware gag in this episode was insensitive. Still, Netflix has chosen to have the episode removed in a blanket action, removing any and all depictions of blackface. Chappelle's Show when Chappelle's show came on the air in the early 2000s, comedian Dave Chappelle used the platform to create some incredibly groundbreaking racial comedy. Many of the sketches from the controversial series haven't aged very well in the eyes of increasingly sensitive audience members, but there's one sketch in particular that the show's creator has a hard time reckoning with. Dave Chappelle only filmed two seasons of the show for Comedy Central before infamously stepping down and quitting the industry for a time. But a small third season was compiled from sketches Dave had left on the cutting room floor. One cut sketch was titled Black Pixie, which featured Dave dressed as a minstrel stereotype. Dave has recounted that while filming the sketch, a white member in the audience laughed in a way that made him question the motives of his comedy. While Dave had intended for the sketch to be satirizing black stereotypes, he felt the audience member was laughing at him simply because he was acting like a black stereotype. Dave has said this experience was one of the reasons he decided to quit the industry, and it's also a small part of why he asked Netflix to remove Chappelle's show completely. The Sarah Silverman Program Sarah Silverman has always been a popular comedian, but fewer people know about her Comedy Central series. The series featured generally absurdist comedy, with Sarah playing a fictionalized version of herself and often getting into comical predicaments as a result of her own ignorance. One such predicament was when she adorned blackface in the episode Face Wars. This episode featured the fictionalized version of Sarah attempting to experience what it's like to live the life of an African American, similar to the situation explored in the aforementioned 30 Rock episode. But Sarah took the gag one step further by having her makeup done in the style of an authentic minstrel performer. Sarah has since come out and denounced Face Wars and has made the episode unavailable for purchase digitally. It's often been used to attack Sarah Silverman due to the fact that the comedian has been outspoken in favor of cancel culture, which many view as hypocritical. Now it's time to hear from you. Did you know that several modern television shows have been removed from the air due to blackface? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Trender if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.